<laughs> uh, so, so the next question, this question is, is it effective to do hypertrophy training and power training in the same week? Uh, that's the question. So I think in this, we should talk about DUP type training uh, and how you can in fact add hypertrophy and power training within the same week. You wanna go for it, Miguel? Awesome, yeah, sure. Yeah, so <laughs> if, if you do uh, hypertrophy and power within the same week, it really has been shown to be beneficial. Um, before what was, uh, well, let, let, let me preface this by saying that we have seen literature showing that uh, doing an, an undulating model of reps. So let's say, for example, if you are doing, um, let's say, chest three times a week, uh, we have seen that it is better to, uh, let, to do one day you'll do something in the 12 to 15 rep range, the other day in the 8 to 10 rep range, and the other day maybe in the uh, 3 to 6 rep range. And that is, that is better for both hypertrophy and strength than doing every day at either, uh, sets of, uh, either sets of 10 to 12 or doing all days of three to six. Now, because hypertrophy and strength are so disruptive and they take you so much out of homeostasis and they are so demanding, they can't be placed very close together. So because of this, it has been shown that putting a power day in there so that that eight to 10 rep range day in there can actually allow for better recovery and actually promote recovery. That way you can do your hypertrophy, power, and strength day. You can stimulate muscle protein synthesis in the muscle through the week and have a day in there that allows you to recover between your hypertrophy and your strength session. So. Within that, it, it is better to do hypertrophy, power, strength, than hypertrophy, strength, power. Because if you put your hypertrophy and your strength together, they are both so damaging and so disruptive that they will interfere with your ability to perform optimally at either. Correct. And that, that was found, um, that research was found by Zordos in 2012, correct? Just like yeah, prior, prior, prior to, uh, to Zordos, the, the, the model of daily undulating periodization was hypertrophy strength power. And then he was right. like, wait a minute, well, 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 let's switch things up here so it actually makes sense. And then he found that hypertrophy power strength is better than hypertrophy strength power. Excellent. I don't think there's much to add to that. I mean, that was an excellent debriefing of the subject there. 